scheduled delivery for this item was tomorrow but DHL did an excellent job but at the cost of sending this half torn I don't know if you can see gives me a bit of a scare to open it I'm hoping that everything is still intact in there when I open it up Hello YouTube, uh, so what do we have here? I ordered a mount for my telescopes last week. Sadly, there was not one website in the US which had a Skywatcher EQ5 non-go-to mount in stock. And uh, that's the reason why I had to order it off of a company called Flow, L-O, stands for First Light Optics, based out of UK. The scheduled delivery for this item was tomorrow. But DHL did an excellent job, but at the cost of sending this half torn, I don't know if you can see, gives me a bit of a scare to open it. I'm hoping that everything is still intact in there when I open it up. But yeah, so this will be just an unboxing. I will make another video where I would assemble everything and uh, yeah, that's what this is all about. So this is how. Box arrived and it's completely torn from here. So let's see. Let me bring my cutters. Scissor and a scalpel. Should do the job. I mean, of course, if the, the condition of the box were better, I would still be at ease. But at least there's boxes inside of boxes, so I'm a bit relieved. But you can see the, the, the condition of the box. It's completely torn on the, the right side. The instruction manual. In English. There are a few boxes inside the box. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Seven boxes. So this I think is the, the tripod. So let's try pull this out first. So, I've seen a lot of videos, uh, not a lot, a few videos where they uh, unbox and they use uh, a mount like this and they say that this is a not, not so heavy mount but when I see this because I'm, this is my first uh, equatorial mount that I'll be using and when I see the legs compared to the, 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 the tripod that I'm using right now to film this video it seems like <laughs> night and day. So look at the size of this. Wow. The 
this is of course beefy. This is difficult for me to hold it with one hand. So let's open up the mount first. At least I'm relieved that it's torn from the other side of the box where there's no mount. And hopefully this, this little guy, which is empty by the way, has taken a lot of brunt because I think they were expecting it to get torn on this side because of the, the, the difference in the weight distribution in the box. So that is the reason why they, they kept this empty box. Good thing, good good packing job. But of course, let off things. You know, let's close it. There it is now. It's quite heavy. So an advantage of this thing is that it comes with the, the polar scope, Include, it includes the polar scope. The azimuth controls. So I went for the, I opted for the, the manual EQ mount with the slow motion controls. I think it should be somewhere down there buried in the boxes. But then, uh, so you can see that there's the, the opening here where the motor would fit if in case I decide later on to uh, get the dual axis or the single axis drive motors and plug it in here. And that's the, the mounting. Uh, bracket where we would mount the, the telescope. So it's gonna take a look at it later on. Let's see what what's there in the other boxes. Yeah, these are the thing the slow motion controls, the knobs for the slow motion controls. And these here, I don't know what these. Uh, but I think these are the yeah these are the actual slow motion controls, which would uh, take care of either the declination or the right ascension. That's all for this box. Nothing else in here. Let's keep it to the side. Let's quickly go through the rest of them. This looks like empty boxes. Nothing in here. Nothing in there. Counterweight bars and the rest of the tube. Let's still open it up. Let's see. So there are different variations in which this mount is sold. Uh, it, it sometimes comes with, I mean, you have to opt for it. The Alt S extender, which I did not go for. It comes with the motors, of course, which I did not, which is op optional, of course, so I did not want that. These are just empty boxes. Nothing that would hinder the, the, the functionality. So there you have it. This is the unboxing, a quick one. So if you go for the manual mount, it comes with 
the mount itself, the cutaway bar, the slow motion control knobs, the the right extension and acclimation control bars, the saddle which takes the, the mount, the counterweight bars, and the trap the trap bar. Thank you. I would uh, be doing another video wherein I would put everything in place and uh, assemble everything and probably show how the, the the polar alignment goes because I when I try to look for those videos on YouTube probably there might be certain uh, blogs out there where they would describe it in more detail but then on YouTube there are just a few people who have recorded really really old videos some of them are in 360 480 pixels and 11 years 10 years 8 years old and not very good explanation of how you put it together so i might just do that anyway thanks for watching and uh, share this video with your friends and like subscribe to the channel until we see each other next time clear skies